Good morning, everyone. This is podcast part two. It's November, and it's the 20th of November. Going to be the 21st until this one comes out. And um, here's Pascal Friedman, and we got to hurry a little bit. So we've got quite a lot of stuff to do for this monthly update. A lot of stuff, a lot of different stuff happened, and um, I'm excited to tell you. There we go. So first of all, I've got a little bit of a cold. It's it's not dramatic, but it keeps me kind of from speaking. So I apologize right now if you can't understand me. School is going well. I gotta say that my grades have um, have been a lot better than I expected on the on the written part, and not all the way as good as I expected them to be on the um, and the oral part, which is actually the more important one. But um, I gotta say that I'm really pleased and satisfied with uh, with what I'm doing right now. I didn't have any problems to get back into my school with them, and um, I've been doing it on a very high level so far, which really satisfies me. And uh, I gotta say that right now, if I just keep up with my grades as they are. Right in this moment, I will have um, all the credit needed in order to be um, eligible of graduating by the end of this year. This is absolutely amazing. I could basically stay home in 31 and only write my exams. And, um, and this is exactly where I wanted it to happen. It happened so far. Got to try to keep it up. So it's um, it's a little while until Christmas break. Christmas break won't start until the next podcast is out. So until um until uh, December twenty three, I will be um in school and uh, actually end school with um with the day before Christmas Eve. Absolutely amazing! I don't think I've ever done this before. So. School is that. So you have you've maybe heard everything about um, me coming back to the Beehive. It will happen, and it's really good news, I guess. Um, I will show you in this really short presentation how exactly it will work and when I come. We are 243 days away from it, and. Um, I will actually stay a lot longer than I expected to, um, thanks to my fabulous um, host family who will take me again. Thank you, Gail, and thank you, Lowy, by the way. Um, I will be arriving on uh, July 23rd and leave um, back for Germany on September 4th, both next year. So, yeah, I'm, I'm really excited. Um, excited for sure because um, it will be it'll it will be a long way and I'm absolutely looking forward to it. I miss Utah so much and it's I think it's a perfect time to come back, exactly or even better than I planned it to do. So I will. The way there is relatively complicated. And just for your interest, I will explain it to you. So I will drive my car after school on the last Friday of the school year. I will be driving by car to Düsseldorf, which is a really tough thing for Patriot Colonians to do. I will drive there and fly to Paris, spend the night there in a hotel and take the direct flight to Salt Lake City. Um, over the whole course, um, I'm I'm actually winning eight hours compared to Europe. So I will be in Utah at um, two or five p.m. on July 23rd. It will be a Saturday, and I will have plenty of time to do anything I want on this day. So I've I've got plans for it. I will tell you sometime. So on the way back I will do exactly the same thing, just um, 
a couple of weeks later. So if you if you want to see me this summer, you can do it very simple. And it's of course I'm waiting for you, even if you don't know me that well and want to get to know me. Of course it's a mistake, but you will see. Um, I'm available, and you can sort of um, express your determination to see me by uh, marking on Facebook that you attend this event. Um, it's called A Summer with Pascal, and uh, you just put it into the um, into the searching tool and uh, write in that you attended and. Um, well, I will probably send you all updates then. Um, this is basically it um, on this point. So, before we're getting into summer, we probably have to live through a very, very tough winter in Germany. They say it's going to be the hottest one in the last 30 or 40 years, I guess. They heard something like that. And um, winners are are not that much fun anyway, so we'll get a lot of snow and it will be very cold, I guess. A lot colder than in Utah. I just heard that um, that you are also in sort of a similar tradition, um, situation to what we have, but um, yeah. Then we gotta work through the points a little bit in a hurry. Um, I want to say in this moment, good luck to everyone whose birthday has been during the last month. I have always attempted to send you wishes personally, but if this didn't come in for some very odd reason right now, happy birthday. Happy late birthday. Um, and good luck to everyone who got the mission calls during the last month or has left for a mission, although actually I don't know anyone who left last month for a mission, so um, but I hope you doing well and um, you can really have success in what you're doing um, I hope the Lord and the Gospel will be with you um, and I really wish you good luck for your mission. Um, we are completely going to switch over subject again. We're coming back to soccer. And um, I gotta say, I haven't played a whole lot since my last, last podcast. We had um, two games overall. And I have to say that uh, I didn't play. It's it's right now there's some um, spots on this team are really hard to come by right now for me. I'm a little bit out of shape. Um, and uh, I just by the time by the time I get to practice I gotta say that I practice some um, Tuesday and Thursday, which are my two long days in school and um, I feel like I'm dead when I come to practice. And this doesn't really leave the best impression of all to my coaches obviously and I don't get that much playing time, whereas I gotta say that um, today there's another game, and uh, it's a cup game, and probably I will try to um, accumulate a couple of minutes in there and uh, prove myself worthy to be on this team. Hopefully, I will. Um, I will also be able to to make an impact on the field and on the team. As I said, I still have I still have fun playing soccer mostly. And um, it will be a good season. We have fallen a little bit behind in as far as um, promotion battle goes, but we're still in the um, in the upper midfield regions, and uh, we can still climb back to third or fourth spot, and that would be an excellent way to finish off the season after all. And um, I just hope I'm gonna be back next year and be in better shape. So, um, what exactly comes as um, 
as we come to the rest of this regular post podcast because I've got another one coming for a very special subject. Um, I have gotten some private calls and improvements for this type of um, type of podcast and I've come up with um, two ideas. Basically I will always um, publish this podcast on uh, the 21st or around the 21st of a month in case I will not be able to. But usually I will try to put it onto a Saturday because it's when I've got most of my free time and just can do it quietly and well prepared of course. So it will be most likely on a Saturday. I will keep updating those on YouTube because um, Facebook doesn't really carry them. I will always try to upload them on Facebook as well but for some odd reason it will just tell me that it will be taking for about 20 years to upload them and I don't like that. I don't like that at all and therefore I will really double check on those. Um, Yes, I think that would be it for our main podcast. I think that um, we will hear from one another in about a couple of minutes when I have updated my regular, irregular edition to this mainstream podcast. And be curious about what it is. Some of you who follow me a little bit closer may have an idea what it is and um, I hope that you are doing alright and talk to you soon.